This was bad. Yo, what's going on with you YouTube? Jumping Chris here. We're going back at y'all with another vid. And today we have a pick of vlog here in a little bit. But first we need to talk about the release because I were, the sneaker app just happened. But I also want to talk about this week of this whole lost and found. This week has been insane crazy, man. Uh, first of all, EA on finish line was was bad, all right? I know. it's I didn't get EA. But I've seen some people that got EA, so shout out to people that did get EA, congratulations. But I've seen a lot of people also that did get EA, but couldn't get through the queue, and then, or when they finally got in the queue, it all got sold out. So, you know, it's, like I said, this release was going to be crazy. And then today, for the Sneakers app, man, the Sneakers app, it was bad. It was so bad. This, this has to be one of the worst Sneakers app drop I've ever seen. Like... I'm not sure because there was so many people on there or something, but it was so bad because I and a lot of other people couldn't even log in or took a long time for it to finally get in. Um, so I had two accounts. I tried to get in with my first account and I couldn't get in until like a, maybe two minutes left. Like it was kept saying like era, era, or I had to put in my address or it said like uh, my password was incorrect. I, I just, sometimes I couldn't even sign in. It was that crazy. Finally got in though. Finally got in, entered it, you know, put in the draw for men's and uh, GS sizes and all that. Uh, I actually got a W on my son size. I have my son, my little, my young. I can always hit for my son. I just can't hit for myself. And uh, of course, you know, we, you know, you know, we got a little, um, little, little baby right there, you know. But <laughs> took a good minute to get in, and finally got in, man. And I saw a lot of people had a lot of trouble getting in. One of my other accounts, I could not get in at all. I still can't get in till right now, like on Nike. I still cannot get in at all. I don't know what's going on, man. I think there was just so many people wanting this shoot, like so many people, and so many people was on the app. It just crashed the servers. That's probably what happened. But the rumors were, or the stock numbers saying that these were over 300,000 pairs on sneakers. That is crazy. 300,000 pairs, over 300,000 pairs in men's sizes. GS sizes, I think it was 17,000 pairs, and uh, men's size was 300,000. That, over 40,000 pairs in a size 10 and a half alone. If you guys wanna see the stock numbers, this is from uh, Secret Sauce. But with that many pairs being on the app, did I get a W on men's? No, got a big old L on that one. Got an L on GS sizes and, and men's sizes. Wifey didn't get a W either. I mean, you know, I thought Wifey's count was gonna be goaded, but man, this was a tough release, man. I told y'all, I knew this was gonna be a tough release, man. The hype on these things is for real. This is the holiday shoe. I don't care what anyone says, this is the holiday shoe. Over Jordan 11s and whatever else is coming out later this year, this is the shoe that everybody wanted. And even though they were saying that this was gonna be the most produced Air Jordan 1, I get that, and I, I'm happy for that, but I, there's gonna be way more demand than there was actual pairs. There's a lot of L's out there, but there's definitely a lot of W's out there, so shouts to people, and congratulations to all the people that did end up getting W's and then had to, and had to go through all that. If you got a W today, you deserved it, guys, because you guys had to go through a lot, like a lot of stuff. You had to go through all the Ravels, go through the Sneakers app, you know, go I, even the people that put, did put in that work, some people would still end up getting some L's, man. I knew that was gonna happen. Some people was gonna strike out. Like I said, I knew it was gonna happen because it was a lot more de uh, demand than there was stock, you know? They could have made a million pairs and these things still sold out. I'm not sure if bots cooked or whatever. I'm pretty sure they did. What Nike's doing, man. I hope Nike's figure out this whole body protection, man, because bots been cooking on Nike lately, man. Um, you know, I saw some people, bots got like 20 clips, 100 clips, like, it's it's a problem you know the bots been a problem you know that's why it's so tough but um anyways uh with that being said i did end up getting one w locally i didn't get any w's on finish line i didn't get any w's on flex app that's another one i didn't get any w's on flex app now you know shit to me option uh i'm not even like surprised anymore because i haven't got a w all year on flex app so i'm literally about to delete my flex app <laughs> I really am. It's, it's, it's a waste of time. But by a miracle, by a miracle, after I took all L's on the EA on the finish line JD Sports, I got a, a notification I got a W on Hibbits. Like, I I never get W's on Hibbits, so this was a super miracle, man. I You know, hey, miracles does happen. You guys got to put in that footwork. But still, even if you did, it was still going to be some L's, man. But, whew, man, this was a tough, tough release. So, hey, man, let's go pick these up.
Drip Grip, use my discount code JUMPERMAN10, save you guys a little bit of money. It is the best soap protector on the market today. No slippage, no tears, multiple wears, like you said. I've worn these at a sneaker event and all day, and it's still goods to go. So make sure you guys get on that Drip Grip, use my, use my discount code JUMPERMAN10. Now, I decided to wear the Spider-Man joints today. Drip Grip. So, let's get it, guys. Good job. Hey, how you guys doing? Good. I want to start nine. Did you get your crib booty here too? Oh, you won that online, didn't you? I saw you post Yeah, yeah, that. I just... Yeah. Do I go up here or...? It says... I can't believe I'm picking up my dad. Yep. Oof. Appreciate you, man. Thank you. There it is, man. One for personal size. Only in one W. <laughs> it was even it was rough to get on that sneakers out today. Appreciate it, man. All right, we got that dub, man. We done. We done for the day. That's it. Ooh. Feels good, man. It feels good to get a dub, guys. It feels so good. Walk in the store, pick it up. <sighs> this one was a good W, so I'm happy about this one. This one was puts a big smile on my face. But all right, man, let's go home. I'll catch. I'm gonna holler at y'all in a second. We'll talk right, about yes, this. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Retail W, baby. Retail W, man. It feels good. Receipty receipt. Ooh, I'm just. This one's happy. All right, this one I am so happy about. So, hey, even though this is probably one of the wor worst releases, but you had to put you had to put that work in to get these things, guys. And I, I told you guys that from the beginning. Ever since there, uh, we had, you know, information that there was gonna be like the most pairs in stock, like, you know, or like 500,000 pairs. I was like, guys, that is that doesn't mean that's gonna be easy because there's too much demand for these things. Oh, I even got the receipt. Oh, here it is. Got the receipt right there. Woo! Craziness is out for these things. So, my size, personal size. Oh, good to finally have now a retail pair in the collection. Definitely, definitely like super happy about this one, guys. I can't wait to start rocking these things. I might wait. What I do, I just I don't like to wear my shoes right away immediately. I kind of just wait, you know, till everyone kind of beats theirs up and I'll rock it later. I still have my. 2015 pair which is still my first love you know i still love these but it's just good to have this one man it's so good to have these man you know it's i love the story i love the whole storytelling to it the vintage to it man it's just everything about the shoe in my opinion not just because it's all hyped up some people say because it's you know alma manier might be sneaker of the year or whatever but i still say this is the sneaker of the year to me for me what we'll to see what we'll to see once if i ever see the you know, the almond mirrors in hand, you know, and all that. But, ah, oh, this one feels good. This one feels good. For anyone out there that still took L's out there, um, I still tell you guys, man, it's, it's, the price went a little crazy, man. A little higher than I expected, man. I, And I did say that in a couple of my videos. Like, you know, I would have said after release day, once people took L's on sneakers and how this release was crazy, man, price is at like a high 300s, low 400s, even mid 400s in some sizes. To me, that's kind of crazy. You know, if you guys still want a pair, and I'm sure a lot of people's gonna want a pair, especially for like holiday season or you know for Christmas and all that, give it about two weeks or next this week. Give it about next week once people start to get pairs from sneakers. You might see the price drop a little bit, but do not you know wait too long because this is the holiday shoe. This shoe will go up for holidays. This is the one that everybody's gonna want. So don't you know wait too long. But if you can, if you guys can wait, you know, in a couple months, these things might touch, you know, maybe mid 300 or something like that. And then, you know, of course, it might go back up during tax season. But we have to wait and see, man. Like, I, I don't know. I, I know like a lot of people in the comments said these are going to brick out and be like 200. These ain't touching less than 300. I say tuned, I'll probably do like a hold and sell video because I think a lot of people gonna, uh, might want to see that. Let me know if you guys want to see a hold and sell video. 
I think these things are gonna probably do some decent numbers in the long run. Appreciate y'all, I love y'all. Hey, congratulations to all the people that end up getting W's today. Uh, you know, congratulations, I'm happy for everyone. And for everyone that did end up taking L's, like I said, guys, just be a little patient and see what happens. Just see what happens in the next one to two weeks. Anyway, guys, love y'all. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do drop vids. And don't forget to follow me on my social media at Chris on IG, sometimes on Twitter, and don't forget Snapchat. And I'm also on TikTok. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm Chris. Peace.